Hey, what's up guys, you beautiful, beautiful people. My name's Ollie and welcome to Shockbox. Today, oh my god, do I have a treat for you. We have Project Scorpio Edition Xbox One X. Da, 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 da. Look at that font. Ooh, sexy font. Now this box is weighs a ton. I'm not even exaggerating. So you've got some facts on the back there. You've got some stuff on this side and on the front. It's exactly, or the back I should say, it's exactly the same as the front. Ugh. So we're going to be unboxing this today. I'm very excited. Let me know in the comment section what questions you've got. And uh, without further ado, let's get in this box. All right then guys, so here we are with the Project Scorpio edition. Oh, it's so exciting. I'm super jealous to get in here. Uh, like I said, this is a slightly different setup than we used to because we're actually having our studio built right now. But hopefully this is pretty good and you guys get a good idea of what's inside the box. So let's get started here swivel it round and as you can see I'm gonna lift up <laughs> alright so first of all we've got a little pack here okay so in here we had a couple of things we had a quick start guide we had a code for Xbox Live and we had a code for the Game Pass which is really cool. Some accessories here so let's take this out and have a look. Let's push the Xbox back for a second. So in here we've got a little power cable because now we don't have a big power supply similar to the Xbox One S. Very nice. And on the other side we've got what looks to be that's right, HDMI cable, which I believe is HDMI 2.0, which means it's high speed, so that's 4K 60 hertz available from it. Uh, and then inside here we have the controller. There we go. So this is the Project Scorpio Edition controller. So blacked out keys there. Uh, it looks really nice. You can see it says Project Scorpio. Maybe you can. It's a little out of focus. But it says Project Scorpio here. Also, the bit at the top uh, is different to what I've seen before in that this used to be a gloss, whereas now it's just a continuation of the, the plastic, which is kind of cool. Oh, and of course, don't forget the AA batteries. Okay, so returning to the box here, you can actually see we've got the console inside. So let's try and lift this out. Okay, so I just noticed in this little box here, which was next to the Xbox One X, is what looks to be a stand, which I am so excited about because I didn't actually think it came with a stand. Uh, it's one of my most favorite things about the Xbox One S, the fact you can stand it on its side. So uh, yeah, that's really cool. Okay, so taking off the plastic here, or the foam, I gotta say, this feels really dense. This is really heavy. I've heard people refer to that in the past, but uh, until you hold it, I don't think you can comprehend how heavy this actually feels. It feels way heavier than it should for its size. So we're gonna take off the uh, little foam packaging here. It's on its back, let's pull it out. Oh, there's a little cheeky look. Very nice. Whoa. Okay, so here we go, guys. So there's the front, so we've got the power button there. We've got the sticker, which you can remove. And I don't know if you can see it, it says Project Scorpio there, which means, well, it's the Project Scorpio edition. Now, one thing I've not seen in other videos I'll try and pick it up so the light can see it. But this is a textured finish on the top, really nice. I'll try and zoom in in the picture so you guys can maybe see that. But man, it looks really cool. So on the back here, you've just got the power supply. You've got HDMI out, HDMI in, two uh, super fast USB 3 ports, I believe, uh, infrared out, uh, the audio connector and an ethernet port. So that is pretty damn awesome. Okay, so I've just fitted the stand there and there we go, that's what it looks like with the stand. Uh, it looks really, really nice. So I prefer standing my consoles. Let me know in the comments section whether or not you have it this way or you like to stand it like this. Obviously, I can't really do that because I've just got the stand implemented, but you can remove it. But let me know which way you typically store your consoles. We've got the infrared uh, taker there, the sync button here, and the eject button here, and then the USB port as well. So one cool thing I've noticed as well is the fact that this button's actually a metallic paint color. Uh, it looks really nice in the hand. Uh, it's not like the plastic that we've seen before, it's really, really cool. And this is a kind of a closer look here at the front of the console, which as you can see, looks really nice in this kind of two-tone paint scheme. So one of the cool things about the Xbox One S is that you could place the controller along the top. So this is similar to the Xbox One S. It does actually sit on there quite nicely, but it's not quite as rigid as the Xbox One S and it does have room to be knocked off. I still really like the fact I can put the controller on here because it means I don't need a separate stand, 
but uh, I thought it was pretty cool to point out. So there we go guys, that is the unboxing of this glorious Xbox One X Project Scorpio edition. Let me know in the comment section what you think about it, but for me, it all comes down to whether or not Xbox is going to have the game lineup to compete with the PS4 Pro. It is more powerful, it's smaller, I think personally it looks nicer than the PS4 Pro, but that's kind of subjective, but it all comes down to the games. So Xbox, you got some big titles to compete with on the PlayStation platform. I hope you do it. I'm rooting for Xbox. Uh, it's where I'm going to be playing most of my games, I think. And um, well, I'm just, I'm really excited to see how this next generation or current generation comes together. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Share it with a friend if you think they might be purchasing an Xbox One X and want to take a look at it. My name's Ollie43 and I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.